Hi guys, I'm just going to go through the very basics of how to use torpedoes. Why sometimes it might seem like they aren't working. So I'm just going to try and explain what's going on. So the first things first, you don't want to use formations, you want to control them individually. To find out where the enemy is, you can look here, it says north, which is that way, but to find out a better example of where they are, you can press AI and that will show you pretty much exactly where they are. So click it again and they'll stay going in that way but not being controlled by the AI. So he's going to be the lead ship. If you hold down control, it changes the right mouse button to a follow. So you can hold down control, click on the ship in front and then they'll follow that ship. So we've now got all the torpedo bo boats following each other. So all you're going to be doing is controlling the front one. Now if you set them all to off on here, their deck torpedoes, their deck launchers are not going to rotate and track the target. So as your ship turns, they will continue firing or pointing the way that they're pointing currently, which looks like they're pointing backwards. Might be pointing forwards, I can't quite tell. But let's say they're pointing backwards. By the time you get into contact with the enemy, the deck launchers are not going to be pointing at the enemy in time. So when you turn, they're not going to fire immediately. And so you might be wondering why why is it not firing? Why is it not firing? And it's because you've had them turned off, that it they're pointing the wrong way, and it takes quite a long time for the turret to traverse. So rather than put them on off, you can just leave them turned on. But because none of them can point uh, shoot forward, as long as you're heading directly at the target, they're not going to fire. So you're safe. For them not getting um, shot early because you're going to be pointing directly at the target that you're aiming at with these only having a 0.9 kilometer radius as well the uh, they're not going to fire at things miles away to the side but if you were using a longer torpedo deck um, which had a longer range sorry there's potential of them accidentally shooting early at targets to the side. So you can manually click to aim at your target to make sure it doesn't auto aim away from the target. It will only fire at the target that you've clicked on. So I can click on him. He's only going to aim at him now. So you have to do that with every single one of your um, guys. So now they're all aiming at him. They're not going to accidentally fire at a different target. You can leave them turned on. They're not going to shoot by accident because you're heading ex straight towards the target. As long as you don't miss click like I just did. So you're safe now. The turrets... Uh, the the launchers are tracking the target. They're ready to fire off as soon as you're ready. So now what you want to do, when you get to this stage, is you want your front, your third, oh these guys are miles away, that's a shame. But you want number one, three and five in a new battle group. 2, 4 and 6 in a different one. So now all you do is you select number 2. So now instead of following him, he's going to be going off to the side on his own a little bit. You now want number 2 following number 1. Uh, uh, sorry, number 3 following number 1. Number 4 following number 2. 5 following number 3. 6 following number 4. So now what we're going to do here is the first ship is going to aim 
behind and try and take out the rudder. The second ship is going to go towards the front, turn early and aim at their near side. So he's going to be going behind and then outside. He's going to be going towards and then near side. So that's the plan. Unfortunately my boats are quite far spread out, which is a shame. I should have uh, given them a bit of chance to get in formation at the beginning. So as you can see, he's now trying to get away. I may end up having to switch the roles, this guy going on the outside, the one behind coming on the inside, because this one looks like it might die. So because it's getting quite low on health, you can now just fire your torpedoes off. So as you can see, it's shot immediately, and that's because we left them turned on and so it was already tracking the target. So if we're lucky we took out the rudder, which we did, so now he's going to have a harder time turning away from follow-up shots. Now if you're too close, the torpedo doesn't have time to arm, so if you want to get a side shot off without the torpedo turn, um, shooting early, you're going to have to manually turn it off as you get into position. Then as you get into position, you can then turn it back on again. So there you go, it's fired its torpedoes off very quickly because I, I didn't turn it off until it was really close so it was already practically aiming in the correct direction. So now I need to hit the front part of the ship. So now I'll try to get around the front before I get destroyed. And I'll turn my launcher on. And then hopefully that one hits the front, which it has. So there you go, that's just a quick tutorial on how to um, use your torpedo boats not in an AI controlled formation but in a player controlled one and how to flank and attack a target from two different directions so whichever way it turns you're going to have a battle line going towards the direction it's turning so they're not going to be able to evade you. Okay, I hope that was helpful. I hope it explained maybe some things that you didn't understand, like why the torpedoes weren't firing in time. Things like that. Alright, take care guys. See you soon.